My grandfather was a coal miner, Westville, Nova Scotia. This is a day in his life. Charlie walked down Diamond Street around three or thereabout. He'd be past the Chelsea School before his kids got out. He'd turn right at the Crockett's Corner. He'd walk up through South Main. Take a left on the Drummond Road. Charlie's off to work again. Charlie sits the riding rake, his lunch can by his feet. Most afternoons, those steel wheels they'd pull him off to sleep. He'd awake in total darkness, their lamps the only light. He'd slave with a pick and shovel till the signal at midnight. Six boys and three girls were born in their little house. Bernie didn't live too long, all the others made it out. My father George, they called him Chappy, it was his dad's pet name for him. Every time he tells me that, always makes me grin. Charlie walks up past the trapper at the end of his long day. Works the ventilation doors that keep the gas at bay. And the ponies pull the full tram cars from the face out to the lift. You catch a ride to the top there, that's another shift. Six boys and three girls are born in their little house. Bernie didn't live too long, all the others made it out. Father George, they call him Chappy, his dad's pet name for him. Every time he tell me that, I can't help but grin. Charlie cuts on through the wash house, across to Campbell's Lane. There's a load of rum doing tonight off Hoyt Street, that's what they're saying. As they will fill his flask as he goes past, they've done it lots before. Then across the path through the Jewelry Hill, and Charlie's home once more. Six boys and three girls are born in their little house. Bernie didn't live too long, all the others made it out. My father George, they call him Chappie, his dad's pet name for him. Every time he'd tell me that, always makes me grin. Cause he says it all oh, so wistfully that it always makes me grin.